Before you start watching, please subscribe to the channel. In a dramatic turn of events, Scotland secured a stunning comeback victory over Norway in their World Cup qualifier match at the Olival Stadium in Oslo. The hosts had taken the lead in the 60th minute through a penalty by star striker Erling Holland. The referee had spotted a foul by Scotland's Ryan Porteous on Holland inside the box, and the Norwegian frontman made no mistake from the spot. As the clock ticked down, it seemed that Scotland would suffer their first defeat of the campaign. However, the visitors refused to give up, and their perseverance paid off with two late goals in the final moments of the game. First, an exquisite header by Che Adams in the 90th minute brought them level, before Kenny McLean's thumping strike in stoppage time snatched all three points for the Scots. Despite Norway's disappointment, they can take comfort in the fact that they are still in with a chance of qualifying, although their chances have been dealt a significant blow. With three matches remaining in their group, they are currently in fourth position, three points behind Scotland and Israel in second and third respectively. Their next match against Cyprus will be crucial, as they will need to bounce back with a win to keep themselves in contention. They will also be hoping that other results in the group go their way, as they look to make up ground on their rivals. For Scotland, this victory will give them a massive boost of confidence as they look ahead to their next match against Georgia. With two wins and a draw from their opening four matches, they are firmly in the mix for qualification, and will be targeting another three points to strengthen their position. Overall, this match was a true spectacle of football, with both teams giving it everything they had. It was a reminder of why we love this beautiful game and a testament to the never-say-die spirit of both teams. With the World Cup just around the corner, we can expect more exciting matches like this one as teams battle it out for a chance to compete on the biggest stage of them all. It was a thrilling encounter that had everything goals, drama, and heart-stopping moments. Norway boss Stael Selbakken will be left to rue his team's missed opportunities as they failed to capitalize on their dominance for long periods of the match. On the other hand, Scotland manager Steve Clark can take pride in his side's fighting spirit and never say die attitude. They kept pushing, even when it seemed all hope was lost, and their resilience paid dividends. For Holland, it was a bittersweet night, as he finally ended his recent goal drought but was unable to prevent his team's defeat. The prolific Borussia Dortmund striker may have scored 59 goals for club and country this season, but it was the goals of Adams and McLean that will go down in Scottish football history. In the end, Scotland's stunning comeback victory was a testament to their mental toughness and team spirit. It's a result that will give them a massive boost going forward as they look to qualify for the World Cup in Qatar next year. As for Norway, they will need to regroup and come back stronger if they are to keep their World Cup hopes alive.